This is Twit. The biggest takeaway from for me, and I'm curious what you thought, Stacey, because it sounded like you were more uh, excited about this, was how little technical detail. They never once measured me mentioned the processor. They barely mentioned the size of the batteries. They didn't talk about the cameras, the megapixels. They left almost all the technical specs out. They announced two new Galaxy Note phones, the uh, Note 20 and Note 20 Ultra. They announced a new Galaxy Watch. They announced new Galaxy Buds. They announced a new Note Tab, a Galaxy Tab. They announced the new folding phone, uh, but left out all the details. I Maybe because it all had been leaked or they knew that the embargoed reviews would be out right after the event. It was disappointing to me because it was, and maybe this is a COVID thing, because obviously this would have, reporters would have been there in years gone by. This was just a big ad with a lot of soft, mushy marketing terms for how so wonderful I, the life would be using their stuff. I felt like we have Apple pioneered this with like tech reporters going to their lunches. And I feel like this is just the end of that. COVID has pushed that. And I think it's probably right to do so because for years, these events have been for two purposes. One, reporters to get all like, woo, you know, get our coverage, but also to get pretty pictures and live blogs and page views and whatever, right? It was feeding the machine. And then your diehard fans and developers would also check in, but they weren't necessarily there to talk about like processing power or megapixels or what. I think maybe they aired too far on the giant ad side, but I think this is where we had been heading and COVID has changed the audience for these right. to normal people. Not just yeah, reporters. Yeah. That's exactly what I was thinking. That, that Samsung has done an amazing job of cornering the market of the regular person. Number two and, manufacturer in the world after Huawei. And, and ahead of and Apple. You, you grab a regular person on, on the street that has a Samsung device, they could care less what the SOC is. Um, they just want to make sure that camera makes them look really good when they're in the club. That's it. <laughs> Of course, I always look really good in the club. Oh, me too. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> in your avocado shirt? I haven't been in the club <laughs> in 40 years, probably, but okay. Uh, I think also it reflects the fact that we're at peak phone, that we are now, every technology gets to this point where speeds and feeds just don't matter anymore. Right. That you assume it's going to have a great camera, it's going to have a great screen. Uh, it's a note, so it's going to have a stylus. You don't. You don't sweat the details. In fact, they spent more time talking about the color, Mystic Bronze. Because that's what sells. <laughs> then it, yeah, that's what okay. people want. So that's what I want to buy. I want that beautiful that rose pretty? gold beans. They're just so adorable. Oh, you're talking about the new uh, uh, earbuds. Uh, yeah. So yes. I want to get. Like I'm going to get up, yeah. everything in bronze. <laughs> I'm going to bronze <laughs> all the things. It's uh, just so pretty. So here's what I, I don't. So are you going to order one of these? Uh, no, no, I don't. I, I'm not fancy. Although no. the flip phone, I gotta say, like, you want to be around, fancy? Yeah, no, they even have a new one. I'm like, I would, I would totally. That is like, give it to me. And now but it's how much is it again? Up, Scotty, Mystic Seven hundred ninety nine dollars and ninety nine cents. And now so in five G. I feel like my next phone, even though I'm ride or die for you know Pixel, I'm looking at that and I'm like. Yeah. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah, it folds in half, it's, so it's nice and compact. I really love this uh, hinge idea where you you got a little, it's like a little mini laptop. You've got a screen on one half of it and like an controls. You remember the i uh, iPods? Yeah. The it's little about screen that size. That watch. It's like that size. Tiny I know. Little so screen. It's, I think it's neat. Oh, They're doing nice that, by the way, with the new Galaxy Fold as well. They said that this hinge will also have an infinite angle so that you can do the same thing. So the Fold, by the way, is going to be a very pricey phone starting at $1,200. Um, I Here's what I've, after thinking 1, about. 1200 yeah. I think, right? Here's after. I thought, thought the Fold was more than that. Well, it goes up 1400 Or maybe it's. 
I don't know. Let me learn more. I, I got to look again because yeah. for some reason I thought I've it was reserved more it that. already. So here's what I yeah I know I don't care about the price because it's for work right because I want to do something as an experiment. One of the things they really were pitching is the is the Samsung ecosystem. Everything yeah. works better. This is what Apple says has been saying for years. Everything works better if you're all Samsung all the time. So get the fold, get the earbuds, get the watch. So I think to do it uh, justice, I'm going to have to go all in. So I uh -oh. and I thought, well, we haven't really tried any of these folding phones yet. This is their uh -oh. second and a half generation. I'm glad the advertising's coming back in. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're gonna. This is probably I don't know. It's gonna be a lot of money. I know, uh, as much as a real computer. But I I think I'm gonna get and I'm gonna get it all in Mystic Bronze because then it'll all match. I'll get the bean shaped earbuds. Those are hysterical. Let me see if I can show you those. Those are so funny. I want to talk about those because I can't imagine them staying in my ear. Well, you're, you don't have a bean-shaped ear. More than likely, they also come with some additional uh, wings. Does it, oh, does no. it have oh, rubber? No. no wings. Look at her. She's either in great pain or having a good time. <laughs> can't tell. Does it have the rubber tip or not? It's like a young Lindsay out. Lohan. Look at that. A lot of freckles. Wow, it does. Yeah. yeah, it's got a little rubber tip. But uh, a lot of the true wireless buds that you see on the market, uh, the ad never shows the additional tips that comes with them. Oh, uh, yeah. they well, these will have, have tips. But look at the size of them. Oh, yeah, that, that tip is so is so. It's wide. Shallow. It's got two drivers in it, it looks like. Oh, mm -hmm. Wow, two drivers is pretty cool. Yeah. So this, um, this is going to be interesting. Uh, they have not announced, I don't think they've announced a price for these. The watch, which is pricey, I think it's 400 bucks, is not Android Wear. And I think this is where Samsung's starting to see some benefits of creating ties in its own operating system. I feel like, you know, they they mentioned, but then had to say a little caveat, uh, not available till we get FDA approval. But their new watch will, presuming it gets approved by the FDA, have blood pressure, have oxygen level, it'd be an oximeter, Whoa. Mm -hmm. and an electrocardiogram. Uh, of those three... <laughs> Uh, I think the only one they got FDA approval for was, I can't, it was, it was only one. Uh, it would probably be the EKG. Cause I think the EKG. EKG is pretty established tech. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, Apple I can't imagine how it's going to do blood pressure, but you know, suddenly your watch is going to go. No, 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 no. It's just watching your blood flow. It's, it's probably using the green LEDs, right? Yeah. And then just running yeah. an algorithm. That's, I mean, it's probably not very accurate all, either, right? Yeah, those are only as good as their algorithm. Right. I was looking at my Jabras, and I think what it is is you have to, you'll do the twist when you put it in, right? Yeah. Yeah, and the bean shape they say is because that's your ear uh, canal shape. Yeah. It's kind of bean. -like. I just have weird ears. I, can, I can't. I cannot wear any of the Apple things. They just fall straight out. Yeah. Well, this may not be for you. Anyway, I thought still waiting for Google to fix theirs. I thought I would get oh, all of the Kevin, above. Kevin is watching and he sent me a footnote on the Samsung phone prices. He said those prices include a phone trade-in, so you pay two hundred to four hundred dollars more over the listed price uh, without yeah. the trade. -in. Whoa. So if you have an old note, there is a you can trade it in for the new one. And and one of the things they do offer price. Are, in they, a are they presuming the trade in? No, I don't know. I got a quote that uh, didn't say you have to trade it in. You can you can okay, if you want. Right. The other thing they say is you get a fifty percent return if you return it any time in the first two years in good shape. So you could in two years buy a new one and get a fifty percent back. So they really they're pushing this ecosystem. They want people to live in Samsung land. The same way people live in the Apple world. Yeah. Exact same thing. Yeah.